Hello everyone, this is Grant Friedman and today I am demonstrating Photoshop CS5's HDR toning adjustment um, for Brush Easy. And um, you guys have already seen this photo before. And what I'm going to do now is I am going to um, convert this photo to um, HDR, which is pretty cool. And I guess my first step here is I just want to go in here and remove this helicopter again. Once I have removed um, the helicopter, I'm just going to go into here and go to Image and Adjustments. And then I am going to select the HDR toning um, adjustment here. And this is going to convert um, our image to HDR. As you can see, I've already got everything previewed here, and so it just kind of made a, a slight little adjustment here. And so now what you can do here is you can go in here and you have a ton of settings here, and you can just go in here and, and play with it until you found one that you like. Right now I'm adjusting the radius, and um, you know I'm, I'm pretty new to HDR, so I don't know exactly what all of these do, so I'm just sort of playing around as I go here. So I'm adjusting the strength right now. And so we'll go in here and go through here the gamma. And um, as you can see, the more I do it, the kind of um, less contrast it seems to have. I come back this way, um, sort of brightens things up a little bit. So you can adjust the exposure so it can make it really bright. You can make it kind of darker. Um, Go in here into the detail, and you can see as I'm working through this, it's really changing the look of this picture um, considerably. So if I bring it all the way up to 300, I mean, wow, that's kind of cool. Um, I do really enjoy this this filter, and because I really like HDR photography. So um, as you see, I pulled the shadow up; it kind of um, makes everything a little bit brighter. I can bring the shadow down. Um, really, sort of makes this area over here darker, can bring in the highlights here too. And this probably looks just a little too dodgy for me. And so um, we'll bring that back here and we'll adjust the vibrance as well. And um, oh, that looks pretty cool. And you can just, you can see how this works. And so adjust the saturation here, bring the saturation down so it's more like black and white. Um, so you can just adjust it and to see, I like it. I guess you also have this toning and curved histogram here and you can go in through here and adjust that as well. Um, I'm just gonna sort of bring it back, sort of back to where it was. I'm gonna click okay. As you can see, I've already got um, got it set. But that that's pretty cool. I went from, we went from this um, to this. Wow, beautiful. Anyhow, that is um, Photoshop CS5 um, HDR toning adjustment. Um, thanks a lot, and I uh, hope you enjoyed this review.